French Senate votes raising retirement age to 64. This post received a score of 8,600, with an up-vote ratio of 96%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. French people. Here I go rioting again. Crombopolis Pierre. Crombopolis Michel. French government. 64 smiley face. Question mark, question mark. French people. Everyone disliked that. And U.S. is proposing 70. I'm 56 and just had a heck of a time getting hired after I lost my position thanks to COVID. No one wants to hire 50 plus. Employers have had a fucking whale of a time being able to pull from the exact demographic they want, 25 to 40, experience, certs and degrees, or hiring from overseas if they couldn't find their white whale in the labor pool. I just hope governments actually decide it's an issue before it becomes one. Women over the age of 50 are the fastest growing homeless demographic here in Australia, for instance. Exactly. Want older workers. Stop being so fucking ageist while insisting that your employees be impossibly overqualified. What? It is perfectly reasonable to want an 18 to 20 year with 10 plus years experience, a PhD, and willing to work for minimum wage. You joke. But I once saw a job offer, asking for a 25-year-old architect with a master's, five years of experience, all for mini-moon wage. Everyone and their mother ridicule the company for that BS. They make that shit up so they can go to the government, cry that nobody applied, because nobody wants minimum wage that requires a degree, and get approval to hire someone on a work visa. You can't get a job at 60 nobody hires you at that age in France. Even at 55. So how do you do? They want to fill in jobs that nobody wants to work, with people that are highly skilled but don't get hired anymore because of their age. Like Japan. Because Japan doesn't like paying pension. Japan is full of downright useless, smaller jobs it asks companies to create to accommodate the population. Let's get real here. A huge huge amount of jobs are useless. In Japan it's silly, they have traffic guards where there's no need whatsoever. And the funniest I've heard was four to five people to change a light bulb on a pole. One of them doing the exclusive job of warning passerby, in case they couldn't see the giant red triangle and tape. I think there's some merits. It's basically elder care where you give them a low effort routine. Keeps them mentally sharp and out of hospital. Might end up saving more money. Out of the house and socializing. Feeling like they are accomplishing something, no matter how small. Yeah, not bad. Medical costs have to be enormous for a stay-at-home elderly couple with brain drain. I would rather have them do something and get paid for it, and not lose their benefits. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.